We are uh, throwing a prom fashion show. It's our third annual. Uh, it's completely put on by my two merchandise operations classes. How long did it take to plan all this? About a month and a half. Yeah. yeah. A month and a half, almost two months. Well, you've got the, uh, in terms of when people think of the word merchandising, you think of fashion and things of that sort. Well, our students weren't into the depth of designing the gowns. They uh, did work with local dress shops and tuxedo rental places, uh, local florists uh, to procure and get all these things donated to us. Our, just a great community of folks who donate stuff for us to show off and turn to help drive business uh, to those folks as prom is about a month away. So. Uh, so I kind of advise, but I'm definitely not the driver of everything. I, uh, I help and give little tidbits. I observe what the students are doing, but we have uh, three co-directors uh, split amongst uh, the two classes, the two merchandise operations classes I teach. Uh, and they really drive it, and they work and get uh, folks uh, within the classes on certain teams doing lighting and set design and making all these cool little planets and spaceships. Uh, to calling the businesses and going to the businesses and picking up gift cards to uh, somebody driving out to Mount Pleasant to pick up all the uh, tuxedo rentals. I have done three prom fashion shows, including this one, um, and I have modeled the past two, but this year I decided to take a step back and let some other models have a uh, turn. Um, I really enjoy helping the models. It kind of uh, <laughs> just sees my, um, my hard work come into, come into life. So. How did you guys, how did you each get involved in this? I thought it would be a really fun class to take. Yeah. I've heard great things about Mr. B, and I thought like it would be a fun class to take. Uh, Mr. B is great, and I've known him since freshman year, and I'm a junior now. Um, so he's, he's super, super fun, um, super chill. Um, he knows what he's doing, so go take merchandise and operations if you're at Dow High. What did you learn from this experience today? That you don't have to be afraid of not doing things you keep doing, I guess. Also, we learned how to put on an event. <laughs> Even if there's a bump in the road, like something doesn't go exactly as you thought it planned, mm -hmm. like you can still recover from it and it won't be like the end of the world. I'm super proud of all my students, and they get super excited uh, setting this up. It's, uh, it started well before spring break, and then we had a little hiatus there, and they got right back into it this week uh, and uh, putting on a successful show. It's really fulfilling <clears throat> just to, to see their smiles on their face, and uh, that makes me smile. And they're really able to take stuff that we're talking about in class and uh, putting it in and seeing it like actually in use uh, with this fashion.